Hi there, this is Michelle at michellesizemore.com and that is Michelle with one L in my website link. I'm a Creative Memories Advisor and today you'll learn how to make these cute lemons and limes using the lemon punch from Creative Memories. I also use the micro scissors and the repositionable tape runner. I'm gonna set all of this aside. I'm gonna grab my, my sleeve. These are new from Creative Memories. I'm gonna put this behind it so you can see it better. Um, it's just a big like a uh, sleeve where it's open at the top and the side. And I love these for just putting things temporarily. Like if I'm getting ready to work on a project, I just want to put things together and keep it separate just temporarily from, you know, my, my table to my desk. And you could, you know, if you're going to work on several projects, you could have several of these ready. Some people do their project layouts this way, but anyway, these are the items I'm going to use for this video. So I just put them in here as a temporary holding place. So I used these papers and card stocks. This yellow is from the um, National Scrapbook Day card stock pack from 2023, National Scrapbook Day card stock. This is from the National Scrapbook Day um, packet. I can't remember if it's the extra pack or the um, project recipe pack, but it comes from one of those National Scrapbook Days for this year for 2023. Green card stock, dark green card stock. So that's all that I need for the papers and card stocks. So I'm gonna grab my lemon punch. It's already open. I'm going to punch out a couple of lemons. I only need one, but I'm gonna punch a couple just in case. Punch those out, punch a couple of green ones because I'll probably do something else with the extra ones I punch. And this dark green, I'm gonna punch out a few of these because I only need the dark green for the leaves. Okay, so everything's punched. Oh, and I need to punch this. Again, I'm just gonna punch a couple, but I only need one for, for teaching purposes. Okay, so I'm gonna grab one of each of the yellow the Kelly green and the lighter green. Set the rest aside. And I'm going to cut the leaves off of this dark green. I'm just gonna cut it off. And do two more. All right, and then all I do is take one of my little fruit pieces, and let's do the yellow one, or let's do this green one. I like this green. I'm gonna cut this off of here and just replace it with the dark green. Pretty simple. Now, this is the part that I cut off the, the piece of fruit. So this goes this way down. So I'm gonna mount it like, like that. So I just take my repositionable tape runner and put it on the back of this little lime. And then on the back of the little stem. Oops. Down. And again, I talk about this all the time, but I love the repositionable tape runner for crafting because it's, especially for little things like this. It comes out in clear dots and only sticks where it needs to. The rest comes off on what's behind it. Usually I would work on a piece of cardboard. Um, so just that, and then nothing shows on the other side. Like if you were trying to use a regular tape runner, it would like show white pokey things on the outside that you'd have to cut off. Or if you were using a glue pen, it just gets wet and messy. So I really like this. So then you're just gonna stick this up under here like this. And you've got your lime. And that's how I did the others, just with different colors. Super easy. Hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching my video.